Well, it's day four of the Junior Pacers Hoops Tour, courtesy of St. Vincent Ascension. Today, we're in Brownsburg. We just got here. We got fun. Scott Powers coming. Alze Johnson's coming. Monica Maxwell. This is going to be fun. Brownsburg, the Pacers are in your house. I love this. Uh, it, it's part of uh, who I am. I was uh, going to be a teacher, and uh, that was my degree in college. And I was going to be a teacher in high school. I really enjoy being around the kids, seeing kids want to work, and seeing kids want to be uh, involved and, and use the energy towards positive things. Slide! 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 It's amazing. I know how excited these kids are to meet us uh, each and every day. So I think getting out here with them, you know, and just mingling, it, it just brightens up their day. So. Everybody listen, everybody listen. Look. You're still a young man playing college basketball. Yeah. What's it like working with little kids like this? Uh, it's fun. It's amazing to come and see you here. I see a smile on their face, work with them. I know they want to get better at basketball. They love being around each other. I love being around them. Having them come in and ask me if I, uh, if I play basketball, it's, it's a great feeling because I was once in their shoes. It's great to come out into the community and bring um, the Junior Pacers Hoop Store cared for by St. Vincent out into the community, teach kids skills for their basketball, whether they're playing, um, you know, in their little rec league or, you know, going to go off to high school and play basketball there. It's great to come out and just have fun with the kids. Everybody together. One, two, three. No! no. All my woods will give me a foot fire. What do you think of Dr. Dunk and his style? He not only teaches basketball, he teaches the really life skills to the kids. Yeah, I mean, I think that's huge because, you know, it's all types of things you need to learn if you want to be successful. I think he does a really great job with that. And uh, I think the, you know, Pace's organization just, you know, developing, you know, kids to understand that if you want to be in a certain position, uh, you know, these are the things that you need to know. I love the discipline and the uh, Darnell Hellman's old school approach. We've been a season ticket holder for five years and my kids have been able to develop a relationship with him and he's just a great person. It's what we want to teach here when we do our sports and fitness ministry here is to be able to teach life skills, um, to be able to incorporate that in what they do. So it's awesome to see with the coaches and um, have past players be part of it to invest in other people. That's a huge thing. If you start to remember the discipline you learned in a little camp, just a few hours out of your life, it's like, you know what? I do look better with my shirt tucked in or I do look better when I care about what I look like. Instead of standing around moping and having my hands in my pockets and not paying attention, I'm learning to look the coach in the eye. I'm learning life skills, and that's what I think is really great about this. So there you have it. We're wrapping up day four in Brownsburg, the Junior Pacers Hoop Store, St. Vincent Ascension. Everybody's in the house. We're not done yet, because tomorrow is our last day. We're going to Riverside. So don't forget, check Pacers.com for all the reports.